It's back. Hello. All right, you know better than nothing. So tonight we've got black rhino vapes, a premium <coughs> juice line. We have five of their flavours to pick from, and I think the metal one mud's nice and shiny. Aaron, so while we wait for a few up. people to come in, we will go through the no, flavour range. Oh. No, not while we're on the line. Oh, yeah. We're live. Oh, wow. Quiet. Yes, the right door, right Hi, Lindsay. Yeah, Hi, Lindsay. Hashtag get right Ethan, shut up. So, yeah. So, I'm just loading everything up. What's the top today? Hi, Lorna. No, I'm sir. Right. I'm going to stick his up and see what's happening. Dad, we want to eat. Dad, we want to eat. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. It's up on the direct road. There you go. So each flavour comes in a little bag, a little part, and you have to mix them. Hi, honey. So I'm on the computer today. I'm not on the phone. Yeah, I'm gone. So let me just unravel all these. So at the moment, there's only one flavour mum we'll be able to try tonight, which is the ice the orange one. So unfortunately, that would be it. Well, then you, that's not fair then, is it? Um, excuse so. so I'll just show you one of the little cards that come in the packet. Go on, I like that one. I can get it out of the bag. Come on. Hi, Paul. Hi, Kevin. Hi Paul, hi Kevin. Oh, <laughs> right, these are little business cards they put in with the bag. Remove top, add nicotine, one bottle of four, three milligram, two for six. Replace cap, shape well. Yeah. So I've mixed all these. Hi Dara, mate. Hi Dara. So just for anyone who's querying, I pre mixed these the other day, so they've had 24 hours to stand. And I haven't vaped any. See, so look, all locked in place. So, haven't even been touched. I've smelt them, and they smell really, really nice. So, um, what? Nice shiny mods, all of them. I mean, to new. So, the caps off. And this is the time she chokes me to death because we're all mess. The warm, my normal 24 gauge. Five wraps. Uh, two and a half millimeter bit. On a single cell neck. So, this is the only one we we'll, we'll, won't be trying today. Language more naked. Um, I own a lot of mods, hun. I have five. Yeah, five mechs and various different regulators. So the only one Mum won't be trying tonight, purposely because it's got orange in, is yeah. Rhino Ice yeah. Orange. So leave that to the end. So I'm going to put that one on the dot mod, so we know which one that one's on. We've got Lemon Tart, which smells deadly. I'm really looking forward to that one, so I'm going to save that one for last. I'm going to put that one on my purge. We've got Horny Rhino. So it's called Horny Rhino. Which also smells really, really nice. Yeah, I cracked the 
that unicorn reminds me the smell of it reminds me of one of my friends once so that one's going on the endless v1 and dragon's blood which is blood that's green okay which is going on my ent so right you're about to save me out aren't you look at yours told ya and there goes the other half on his stance which is now dry okay. <laughs> i'm just gonna dry it because he's on that teach her a lesson Lindsay's going lemon tar we ain't calling you nice don't call us nice no Lindsay, doesn't want, no Lindsay doesn't want lemon tar she doesn't want lemon all i have is Lindsay's tar <laughs> no she <laughs> Just you. Mm. Hi Adam. Hi Adam. Dragon's blood smells like it's got lime in. Mm. Oh, so Chrissy won't like that one. I need lessons on the mods. Which mods, Han? We can do that on this one. I don't mind having a chit chat as we go. Have the chit chat after we've done the mine rig, yeah. So, um, mm, smell that. Doesn't it smell like Craig's purple haze? Doesn't it just? Now, if this is like my friend's purple haze, this one I can see being stolen by a few of the admin very, very fast. But I've already cleaned the lemon tart and I haven't even baked it yet. Oh, it really smells like it, no. Yeah. Oh, no, 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 it's already stopped the bottle. Oh. And it's pissing down the side, Darren. So, that is not oh, that. Oh, it's quite Yeah. I will go through the flavour profiles in a sec. Hang on, Chrissy, mm. what are they think you think these? Uh, 70 30s approximately. That one's yeah. quite. Uh, it's not should... running for something. It is, isn't it? Yeah, but they have been left on the table. In the heat by your radiator. Never so. Oh. Makes it easier to squeeze out the bottle. Oh. Oh. Hang on, Adam said something. Black Rhino vapes are so awesome. I have quite a few of these juices. Well, that's nice to hear. I've never actually tried any of Black Rhino's juices, to be honest. So, this is going to be my first attempt. On so, oh, I want to smell that. Really, really, the seven part really does smell nice. That has got lime in it by the smell of it. It's too great, I'll drink it off track. I'll drink it. Wait, I'll soon know if it's got it's lime in it, she'll pull up ice. Yeah, I don't like lime. That's very cool, Terry, I'll use it. And that's very flash. I'm going to share it again. Okay. Oh, they have a drink. Let me know my pleasure. Since that, I've always been doing that before. So. <laughs> So put that one down, and that one goes over there. So what's everyone else vaping tonight while I quickly do this? The great one's good too. Well, I've got five of their flavours here tonight, Adam. And I'll run through the, pla uh, the flavour profile shortly. Just to let anyone know before I start this, I haven't been paid for these review, uh, this review. I haven't paid for the product. These products were sent to me purposely to do this review for you guys. Hi, Darren! Darren Wilkinson. Hi, Daz. So, with that in mind... Do I invite? Yeah. Which Daz is that? The one around the corner or the one mission? Darren's around the corner. Should come over here and have a beer and he can watch it actually live. Yeah, he could Yeah, Darren, come round and have a beer. Darren, do I need to come down? My Darren's just invited you. Darren, come over. How about oh, yeah. Ethan? Be quiet. Darren, can we break it? And then we'll go and start again. 
Um, no, I don't see these being very shiny after some hard skills. But they look all pretty. Right. Minute. So. Mm -hmm. The front of Black Rhino's card reads www.blackrhinovapes.co.uk. You've got the Facebook link at the bottom. And if we flip it round, this is a lovely long list of flavours. Now we have tonight, which is Rhino Iced Orange. Oh, which, there it is. Which is juicy orange with a hint of ice blast. Hi, Walter. Hi, Walter. We have lemon tart. Lemon tart, lemon tart, lemon tart. Well, they even do a lime cheesecake, Mum. You might be interested in that one. Yeah, I'd probably like that. Lemon tart reads the ultimate in dessert vapes. Mm. Well said. We've got a horny rhino. Let's see what that one says. Uh, uh, horny rhino reads strawberry, Born. raspberry aid, and blackberry. Mmm. That's what it says. Then we have black rhino, which is the one you're thinking of, Mum. Which yeah. is no, sorry, black unicorn. Get that one right. Spain corrected. Dark berries, aniseed, and menthol blast. I've invited Charles, but she's already there. Sorry, Charles. Dragon blood. So for dragon blood, it reads a combination of exotic fruits. These are 50 mil, zero milligram bottles, short filled. Right? I've already pre mixed these with my one nicotine shot because I like three milligram. They're approximately a 70 30 PG VG based. Nick shots are included free with a purchase when purchasing. So that's something good to know, so there's no extra charges on that. All our juices contain zero nicotine but come with separate nicotine shots. They also come with the child medicine lids on the bottles. So kids can't open them with your cat and the lock and collar and the nickel all included in the little pack with the little card describing how to mix up and how long for. So, right. What did you use to polish your mix? Your polishing cloth and two dusters because they were really, really grubby. <laughs> so, out of Dragon's Blood, Black Unicorn, Horny Rhino, Lemon Tart, and Rhino Iced Orange. Which ones do you think we need to do first? Bearing in mind, I preferably want to leave the orange one until last. So, I'll let everyone else pick. Or shall I just pick the first one? I want to pick the Dragon's Blood. Dragon's blood first? Oh, Norma says lemon tart. Put the lemon tart, if it's a strong lemon, we'll, we'll knock out the others. I don't think it's a strong lemon, it doesn't smell overpowering. Okay. Okay, we'll go with lemon tart then. So, just for those, lemon tart, the ultimate dessert vapes. I have lemon tart on my perch. And just before. We'll do the black unicorn next. That one's quite a potent one, actually. So, right, go through a quick rundown on the labels. You've got your nice big box at the bottom. This product may contain nicotine, which is a highly addictive substance. Your warnings down the side. And Lindsay's throwing up and gone grey because it's lemon tar. Your approximate mix and bases are along the side. Nice and clear to read. <laughs> Can't scratch them off. No, no scratchy labels. You're all right, Lindsay. <laughs> Got your ingredients down the opposite side of the label. Again, nice and clear. 
Let's see if I can scratch off the expiry date and the batch number. No. And the batch numbers stand up. I can't scratch them off. So really tough labels. None of the shiny, horrible stuff where it all comes off. I can't scratch any of it off. That's good. Which means the labels will really stand up to the wear and tear your pockets go through. So it's linen hard. Yes, you can go live after, sweetheart. No problem. <coughs> Ooh. Well, somebody else wants to do a live, or they want to go live for you? No, oh, Dana. No, Darren wants to go live after. Uh, it's conversation on. chat. Yeah. Well, my first impressions of this is you've definitely nailed lemon tar. I can tell you that one. And I'm keeping this bottle before you can try it. Is Darren, is Darren the round corner the one that keeps it? No, his mum does. <laughs> I don't think he does. I think he lives on his own. Oh. Darren, do you live with your mother? Do you have any The first thing that hits your mouth. I'll let you vape that. When you vape the lemon tart, is sweet lemon followed in by the buttery fresh pastry. Lemon's not right. overpowering. Lemon meringue pudding is what I get. Like a lemon meringue. I don't. I get the as the uh, chosen by you lemon tart so with a creamy buttery base. You'll be able to try it, Kevin. Don't worry about that. When you come down in January. You're going to wait. Can't you send him some? I could do. Yeah, well, I'll put some in the bottle for you. Well, I've got to send him some at down, so. But, yeah, the pastry sort of makes you want more. I think I'll find my table <coughs> one. Nothing like Dinner Lady Lemon's Heart, where it's all sweetness and no. you get the burnt pastry taste, which that is a bonus. That tastes like lemon meringue to me. Nanny's lemon meringue, try it again, now it's warmed up. Shall we really warm it up? Yeah. Crank it. I've just got more pastry and the buttery texture. And it's really warm. Mm. Yeah, Adam, it is really, really quite buttery. But the buttery is not overpowering and neither is the pastry, but there's no bitter, nasty lemon. It's not over sweet and to try and lemon encourage it. No, no, it is. I've got to think about lemon mm -hmm. meringue. So I've, tried, taste like I've tried a lot of lemon tarts. You need to reload that and let the lads try it. And I think if I was going to rate this next to the ones I've tried, Bearing in mind, I found the dinner lady one quite quickly after a while. A vape in a 30ml no, bottle. That all time. I could quite happily sit there and vape this. French lemon tart. Adam says. You will love it. Really, Lorna, you will love it. Yeah, it does remind me of a French lemon tart, Adam. Um... It's not an overpowering smell of lemons, though. Nah. When you smell it, it legit smells like you cracked open a box of the lemon tarts. And you get that nice little lemon bit with the pastry smell. Really nice. Uh, who's going to try this out next? Me? You cannot be allowed to buy. Babe, you want to try the lemon tart? Okay. And we've got Icy out to play. Push the button, babe. Just push the fucking button. You really have to push the button. Stupid mod. It's not a stupid mod, it's a good mod. Yeah, it's nice. Mm -hmm. Could you bake that one all day? Probably oh, not. I'm a huge fan of lemon, but it's. No one likes your snake. It's beautiful. There we go. Tess, do you want to try this one? Terry, hello. Shoot your butt. Yeah, yeah anybody, you anybody that keeps snakes in the like, give or take around Chelmsley and Kingsworth, give oh, us a yeah. shout. 
Well, yeah, we got five now. This one's stuff. It will have to be special to beat Mark. Ooh, is that a challenge, is it? Uh, hi, Harry. Hi, Cray. Oh, I'll cry. No, not yet. Which oh. Craig? Craig Tilburn. Oh, yes. uh, hi, Craig. I you have to push you it. Have it's a big button. Tight and press it. Do you want to come in camera and do that? No, he wants they to blow down my neck. Mm. You're not having it, man. I don't want it. You can have it. <laughs> <laughs> yes, he's very friendly. He was actually hand fed for a while because he stopped eating. He's actually a bit of a midget. He should be a lot bigger. <laughs> so, <laughs> verdicts on that. I'd rank it next mm. to... I actually got that one. That one's quite nice. It's better than the... Um... I like it. I just wouldn't really call it an all day, though. I could rate that all day. I think that was better than the dinner lady one. It's not over-sweetened. The, oh. the only reason I say I wouldn't want to make it is that... But it's I'm very, very smooth. They say it looks like bringing Lorna round to Chris's to make the snack. We have five, Lorna. Five. I have two five. coastal carpet. One's a baby and five. one's nearly full grown. So, the next one we was asked to do was the black unicorn. That's an insight. So, da -da -da -da. black oh. unicorn, dark berries, aniseed, and menthol. Now, the smell of this reminds me of Not on aniseed, my friend's um, purple haze, which is the same sort of principle, dark berries, aniseed, oh, and menthol. So... Let's see if it cracks up. Is that the purple haze that I just got? Yes. I find that one a lot more liquidy than the one we get off our friends. Yeah. And I'm not a huge fan of liquids. Liquid. I'm not saying I dislike it. But... but yeah, the first thing that does get you on this one is the licorice taste, which is from the aniseed. But I like it. I really do. I like Red Astaire. I could quite ha yeah, you know what? I could quite happily sit down and bite that over more Red Astaire, you know? <laughs> I'm not going to be able to have a lot of it because of its got in it. On you certainly get the berries, the first tip of your tongue is your, yeah. on the inhale. You get the blast of dark berries. Mm. Nah, I'll stick to our mates. A bit that too much aniseed for you. Yeah. Same here. So, Terry. You're back over here again. I'm always trying to eat yeah. my dog. <laughs> <laughs> you lining up the doggy. This one's black rhino. It? It's a bit like Master uh, Darren's record. No. It's a bit no, too much no. and a for them. No, we didn't. No, we didn't. I'll get more berries before I get the aniseed. I've got the berries, bro. I've got a lot of aniseed, man. Why have I got seven people? <laughs> Go away, Ethan. Uh, because we always yeah, I get have... the berries. However, I do get a lot of aniseed as well. Yeah. And I'm not really an aniseed fan. It's exactly the same here. See? For us, it's a little bit overpowering on that. Now not this, pretty. because because I vape a lot of red estate, it's normally my go-to vape. I love aniseed and I love the licorice taste. I quite happily sit there and vape that all day. To be fair, it's a nice juice. Move. It's not one for me. Move. Hello. Bye, Ethan. Seem to have a mate that burns. Right. That's black unicorn, yeah. Yeah, that was black unicorn, and with this one we have horny rhino or dragon's blood. Which one do you think? Horny rhino or dragon's blood? Which one next? Lorna likes your little snake, Ethan. What? Lorna likes your little one. Why is she around me, guys? She can see mine. But who's her? Great green auntie Lisa. I reckon Dragon's Blood, because that's the one Mum voted for. No. So, Only right now. Oh, I haven't seen the other cup. What comments come up? I thought you just said Laura. 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 Yeah, she, she yeah, my comments are a bit frozen at the moment, Mum Feed, so we're having to resort to a phone. Is so, Horny Rhino, it is there. Far enough that she ain't coming out Horny Rhino, I've got on my endless clean.
Yeah. Yeah. Honey Rhino. Honey Rhino. Yeah, we've got Honey Rhino in my hand. Yeah. Is that better? Horny Rhino reads strawberry, raspberry aid, and blackcurrant. No, I like the sound of that. No, I've never had a raspberry aid. I've had raspberries and I've had blue raspberries. So this is quite um, a nice one. Hi, Nick. Recommend me a banana sponsor. Hmm. I'm saying that. I think actually Black Rhino do a banoffee pie. Nick, your comments. Mud. Nan, we might have some of the That's Dad, give you that. No, no, it's Oh. So, don't keep the Horny rhino. We got that back. A no, strawberry, no, raspberry, no, 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 Hmm. Don't ever do that again. Banana juice. Best one I've got there. How about stuff? It's a mild, a mild black currant on the end, which is quite nice and refreshing. And as you sort of lick your lips, you're getting the fizziness from the raspberry eyes. What? Definitely get more of the strawberry oh, on the oh, inhale, oh, but it comes oh, out more with the raspberry on the exhale as well. The black currant's just <laughs> subtle on the end, which is really nice. I haven't found a harsh one yet. Okay. Can I have some? I'll just read it so you don't get dry. Num, 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 num. They are really, really tasty. I am quite impressed. I might have to try the rest of them. Mm. Yeah, we'll find one in a minute, Darren, and we'll let you know. There you are. I can never get this one right, so if I start choking, excuse me. Mum's not good with mess. It is really, really nice. I tell you Ooh. what, Darren, if you want a banana bake, you will have to try <coughs> my banana pie or oh, my. Yeah. Banana milk or my banana menthol. Or your banana shake. I haven't actually got them made up yet, but I am quite intrigued to try their banana pie to see if it's any different to mine. There's a lot of flavours on this list that look really, no, I really appetising. Black currants, and I get the subtle taste of strawberry. Terry! This is strawberry, raspberry aid, and black currant. I get the strawberry <coughs> and the raspberry with the fizziness of the, the raspberry aid yeah, on the that. exhale with the subtle hint of black, uh, black currant. But I like black currant. So. What do you get? Let you know in a bit, Darren. Mm. What are you getting, Sarah? That's crazy because I'm just getting nothing but black corn. See, different taste buds. We all, that's why. This is why when I do a review, it's always a mixed version of taste buds going because everyone can pick up on certain flavors. It's like if there's lime in taste the piece. Yeah, well, that's... I'm getting a few, but I'm just getting, as far as flavor is concerned, I'm just getting black corn. But do you know what? I could buy Okay, like Lindsay, so speak to you later tonight, love. Bye, Linz. Would that be an all day vape for you? You reckon? Yeah, quite ample. Yeah. I actually ought, I mean, all's quite nice. Still yeah. cold. There we go. Bye. 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 Come and slurp on me. You better put some in here. Big Daz, you miss your mate, what's the flavour of this? I don't say not to this is horny rhino, which is strawberry, <laughs> raspberry aid, and flush. Excuse me, Minnie. Donna! 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 Don
Hey, back in. Missing move. Now. What do you get? Mum and Terry just got the black home, but I've got all three. What's my green? Strawberry, raspberry aid, and black home. I've got a speckle bit of black currant with the strawberry and the raspberry aid coming through on the inhale and the exhale. I can definitely get the strawberry. And the black hole, obviously. You get the fizz from the raspberry egg. Mm, maybe a little bit. So that's four different opinions, but we all like it just the same. Yeah, I actually do like that one. Did you vote that one all day? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I probably could actually. So there you go. Four votes, we could all vote horny rhino all day. So, last but not least, so Mum won't be joining in on this one. So I'll leave it till the end then. Is the orange, but now we've got dragon's blood. Mm -hmm. Get ready for this. You'll know if it's got lime in it, her face will change. Mm -hmm. You don't want to change my car. Oh. Dragon's blood, a combination of his off appearance. It smells like it's got lime in it. Mm -hmm. You're still with us, Lorna. Can you see what I've got, Lorna? She's going to get you what? You'll get more. There's a bit of fizz to it. That's how many seeds you've got. Oh. This stuff. Oh. Maybe a bit of pineapple-y. Yeah, I've got a little bit of fizz to it. Yeah, I've got a little bit of fizz to it. There's no, there's no aloe vera in this. Can't taste I've that weird. That. I haven't got that weird texture in my mouth on that. But there's sort of a menthol kick to it. Yeah, it's not very good. Yeah, it's not the one bigger than the other? I'm not about to say. It's because of the angle. Tastes like there's a bit of pineapple. Definitely a bit of pineapple. It's got sweetness from the pineapple sort of taste. That's my least favourite, it gives me a headache. I think there's mango in that one. Tropical fruit. Ooh. Yeah, it sort of surprised you. The different flavours pop in your mouth. Just you try and figure one out. <laughs> that one's a really nice one. That's the sort of one I could pick up quite happily. Like nerd piece, Tilly. Yeah. But it leaves a tingle on your lips just like a menthol does. No, it's more like it, it sets my tongue up. It's your eucalyptus, not menthol. I'm quite intrigued. Uh, <laughs> Still here. <laughs> no, it's not because she's still here. Um, oh, I'm trying to oh, copy there so I can make the comments. Um, yeah. That's a really puzzling one. I can't put my tongue on all the flavours. But I definitely, I definitely would I like say it. there's a bit of mango in there. Yeah. I've got the mango. I've got the mango and I've got pineapple. I've got the pineapple sweetness already. Oh, Right, hello. One of you two want to try this? See, now I didn't get the line from that. Dragon's dragon fruit, lemon, lime, pineapple, coconut, with a few more. That's what it was, dragon fruit. I actually like that, and that's got liming. I'm quite impressed with that. No, not liming it. Not the same as liming, is it? I don't get the coconut. I can't taste the coconut oh, no, in that. Right. But I can taste. I can taste the pineapple. Where's the decorations? I can taste the hint of mango. Hi, John. 
What do you think uh, of the one uh, on the uh, right? Go through. <coughs> I'm getting a lot of coconut fruit up. Yeah, there's coconut in it. Yeah. yeah. What are the flavours to get? Uh, I didn't. I was just getting a lot of coconut. I've got a lot of coconut fruit, to be fair. Give it me. Have a fruity flavour. Yeah, it's probably the dragon fruit. No, it's warm. Yeah, they're better dry. They would have set that dry. I cannot taste lime in that, which I always quite impressed me. Yeah. I actually lo like that. I actually fun. found a lime juice that I like. Hi, John. It's amazing. There's a lime juice I actually like. Wow. Yeah, I don't like juice lime. juice with lime in it. Oh, yeah. I don't it's like lime. Forget this. I like chocolate limes. Ready? <laughs> 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 Three, two, go. I'm still not getting the line, but I like it. No, uh, we're both exactly the same, Nathan. You want that one? Yeah. And they're both really <laughs> I want that now. Okay. So, the verdict so far is we all like them. Oh, yeah. We've all got separate opinions. We all find them very <laughs> smooth. We all picked up on different things in the frame. Oh, nice song, don't even tie a strap right? I was getting the dragon fruit now, it was warm, but I still didn't get no lime. I've got the lime. I've got lemon, but, but I didn't I get the lime. I've got coconut. I've got a subtle hint of coconut. Go fruit first, you'll get a hint of coconut. I've got one bag of coconut. Let's do it a little bit. Stop. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Oh, it's so good. Oh, it's so good. It's so good. Oh, yeah. It's when it gets warm, you've got that touch of coconut. Oh, I really do like that one. No. I found a lime one I like. Well, she likes Nobnicked it. So, that one only, can't touch. this is the only one Mum can't activate because it contains yeah. orange. Yeah, so, it upsets her stomach. One. This one yeah. is Rhino Iced oh. Orange. Yeah. So, Rhino Iced Orange reads. Where is it? 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 <laughs> a juicy orange with an icy blast. Excuse me, you two, you're needed for this one because I've had to chip. It's yeah, orange. But... So, first verdicts. Now, I'm hoping this isn't a peely orange because I don't like peely fruits. So, when it says it's like you... summer, I don't like peely ones. Right, I'm going to step out while the orange uh -huh. one's going off. It's not peely. Oh, yeah. Who's oh, doing yeah. angry faces? Me. The Bob steps out the picture. Uh, uh, Ethan, you. Right. Oh, you're loving warm. Hmm. No, oh, my little baby. Well, Why my big. Then? Well, my big baby. Yeah. I don't know. Right, go on then. So have some cough syrup, babe. Yeah. Right, what we got? It's definitely not a peely orange. Hi, John. <laughs> it's quite a refreshing sweet orange, not like the bitter orange juice you get for like the breakfast orange where you get the tang. Quite a refreshing smooth orange, no peely taste. Really nice. And I think the ice hit to it makes it more enjoyable. Yeah, I can now try this. Rhino Iced Orange. Snappy. I'm looking at that. I like that. You're not that having it, it's mine. Like that. I like that. That's nice. Like that. That. I don't care, that's nice. That is a lot. That. That's all of it. I tried that for my RX. See, it's not peely at all. Really nice. It's like mm. you've got a glass of Tropicana and Orangina. Took the fizz out of the um, Orangina straight out of the fridge, but put Tropicana orange in it instead. Oh, wow. 
it's sort of a mix of best of both. Yes, it does make your mouth water, girl. It, it really is a mouth water and orange. It's not the peely yeah. one. No, it's no, not you over sweet. The lemon tart. I can't get my hands on it. You're not having it. Mm. Crouch down, I can't see you. Sorry, guys, but I actually do like that very, very much. And Terry's not a mental person either. Right, Darren's available now. Let him have a go at it. Mm. That one is really nice. Right, let me just read it, and we'll get Darren's point of view on it. Seriously, I'm gonna try that. Get in there, Dad. Try that one. That one's really nice. Ow! Smashed my knee. Catherine, while you're at it, Dad. I need a cab. Yeah. How you doing? Believe me, that machine's mine. That's not right. I have the rest of it. What do you get? What orange would you say? I would say it's a mix between Tropicana and Orangina. Probably say so diluted Orangina. Yeah. It didn't taste like orange in it. You know what that smells like? I'm getting a really strong. Um, like clementine stuff. Um, I find mm -hmm. it's just a hint of orange shirt. I just quite like. There we go. Thumbs up. You're not going to be fancy. Would you like? I said he could have one. Like I've got my tablet. I've got your tablets here. And normally I won't touch orange of any kind. <laughs> clementine. <laughs> Definitely coming soon. Hi, Damien. Hi, Dai. You've just come in at the end of the review, mate. You can join us for the chit chat after. So, as far as this goes, I'm stealing that lemon tart that's mine. I am also stealing the horny rhino. Night, Darren. And I think I've gone to uh, steal that one because I love my licorice. And I think Darren might actually steal that orange one off me. Yeah. If Terry doesn't. So, from me, so far, I haven't found one that I don't like. And I actually found a lime bait that I like. So, I'd say, Grooming Juices, yeah, you've got that one now. Lord is asking you, yeah. do you want to share your lemon tart? Yes, I'll share you with some. I always, I'm always happy to share stuff, so that's not an issue. I will do you some. I'll put you some in a 30 ml bottle, bud. Um, Darren Milk. What coils? Four, 45 ml, eh? Yeah. Oh, no, That's one for you. What's a clot? 45 ml. Like? Don't that. you mean cult? What's so sad? You're lucky, Lorna. She won't no, let me out, then, but I would definitely recommend, so far, out of the five I've tried tonight from Black Rhino Juices, I would definitely recommend them to them. And I am quite looking forward to trying some of their other flavours. I do. plenty to choose from. Is that to put a power now, Chris? Hi, Lindsay. Yeah, we did the Black yeah. Unicorn, but Lindsay. it is more... Damien. I'm getting messages. Yeah, them are old ones. It's only just started working again. Look. Mm. Does it say cult? <laughs> no, no one doesn't say cult. <laughs> so, has anyone got any questions about the juices we've reviewed tonight? I don't need any. Share the card again. There's their lovely flavour list. And there is plenty to choose from, so there's some for everyone. Bright logo and the link. The link is also in the pin post. So if you want to go check them out, you can easily find the link. Just click through the pin post. They're right at the top. Go and buy a number order because on the sponsors, I've sort of gone up, and on the vendors, I've gone down. So you sort of, sort of meet in the middle. But the other flavours, which we haven't got here tonight, read 
Blue unicorn of Hall Minty Ice Blast. Banoffee pie. Mouth watering banana dessert. Rhino Berg, our take on Heisenberg. What's the white bit on your mug? Which mug? Oh. This one. That white, white bit head. there says dot mod. Then we had a rhubarb and custard, classic childhood sweet. Strawberry chewy brings brings you right back to your childhood. Summer shirt sorbet, which is a fruity, refreshingly cool. Toffee mint, creamy, minty, flavoured sweet. Oh, now that one sounds really nice. Okay, Adam, speak to you yeah, later, mate. It's um, a rhino cola. It's cola bottles. A kiss. Kiss the red, sumptuous red berries with an icy blast. Mm, that sounds nice. Mm. Melon berry. Now, why couldn't you send me that one? Did I do a spearmint rhino? Did I do a spearmint rhino? <laughs> uh, that would probably be blue unicorn, babe. No, I was thinking the Eskimo. Trust you. <laughs> <laughs> Melon berry blast. A yeah. fruity mix of melon and berries now i'm a big fan of melon and berries so i might have to try that rainbow candy full of fruity flavors just like the popular sweets Ooh. now this one i know my husband would love to try which is rhino iced mango sweet tropical mangoes with an icy blast hi kilo hi kilo and we have fruit salad classic childhood sweets what are mm. the oh, sweets? I remember them. Rhino iced apple. Tart apple with an icy blast. Ooh. Well Rhino like iced grape. Sweet red and green grape with an icy blast. Mm. I can see why Adam likes the sound of that one. Lime cheesecake, a classic dessert. We now this one, now next. this one really sucks. Considering I not long not ran out. Well, I did. I ran out of my Danish swirl from Baked Delights, so which I was really quite enjoying. And they have a oh, Danish swirl, a classic combination of pastry and cinnamon. Now that would have been the perfect combination mm. compared to the Baked Delights one. Yeah, it would have been, but unfortunately we've only got these ones. Um, I use the white stuff because it holds a lot more juice and it also burns less easy. It's 47 pulls to slightly singe the white stuff, which is cotton that I've read from my coils, Lorna. Yeah. But I am really impressed. Now, yeah, I've, no, no. now I can see me buying the rest of these and I, doing a second part. I'll soon let you know if the orange was in the rhino juice. <laughs> Sets me up. So, has anyone got any questions? Lorna to ask one about oh, lime cheesecake. Yeah, I am quite impressed to see how that lime cheesecake turns out because the lime in it might be like a key lime. It might be different. Yeah, but I've had key lime juices before and I didn't like them. But you've had a lot of the key lime ones you've had have been sour instead of sweet. Could be that. So, so has anyone got any questions? I'm going to go for some more black wine now. The dragon blood. Dragon blood. Oh. Mm. Mm -hmm. No, no more comments. Well, if they are, they're a bit slow. Okay, so if that's it for any questions tonight, I would definitely ring, recommend. Oh, look, Darren's playing my pussy cat. <laughs> that looks wrong, Darren. <laughs> 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 
Oh, I definitely would yeah. recommend yeah, them. No, there no, is no. loads of braces. In flavors. the pin post, babe. Yep. Oh, no, I think I feel. Oh, bro. Lorna's laughing. Right, if there's no more questions, wow. we will call it a night. Nice. I will see you back tomorrow oh, for a review on uh, what was it? Mm. Cloud Sorcerer. I won a competition and I've got some samples from them. So over the next three days, uh, we'll Darren, do on that on the free chit chat in a bit. Uh, Darren wants to know about the different mechs that you've got. Uh, which one would you like to know? We might as well do it now before I end it. I have the Endless V1. Okay, Lorna. The Endless Clean. My Purge. I'll probably have some more water my dot mod and my ENT from Nova Base. So which would you like me to talk about? I don't actually sell them. None of them are a cult. That one? Yeah. 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 Can't talk about a mod we haven't got. I'm thinking of buying one. Well, uh, which one would you like me to give your uh, my opinion on? So use and ease. With the purge, if you like a heavy mod, I'd go for purge, but it is more costly than the others. I will state that there is a huge bloody wine on this compared to all my others, which have got quite a short wine. Days, it's so the strong magnetic button, which I find. No, it's Chris's dot mod, heavy. Yeah, you gave me not, so you gave it up. Indian giver. So <laughs> that's the wind on the purge. Quite a big wind and quite a massive button. Kevin's saying my dot mod, love. It was Kevin's dot mod. <laughs> it was. It's now mine, not having that. But yeah, for a weighty mod, Purge and you can't beat it, it does hit like a champion. And this is the silence of RDA. You've got the nice deep engravings of the Purge. This is a Purge Back to Basics V2 with the silence of RDA cab. And you have to build quite high with your coils to line up with the airflow on the cab. To get the best vapor reduction and flavor from it. It's but it does fit. It's an eight, uh, 18650. Kevin's laughing and says, I don't want it back, love. It's my least favorite. Oh, very really, really good, that one. <laughs> you don't have it back here. <laughs> um, as far as the endless V1 goes, it is very interchangeable. It is endless, so it's just basically simple. This one's a spring because it's the V1, which makes it quite easy to press. The little black disc there is to help adjust for battery rattle. If you're last, you can't just try, try and just And the sleeves the are as simple yeah, as slip it off and pop the next one back on. So you're very interchangeable. Uh, it's a hybrid uh, 510 uh, connector on the V1. And I have the Salmon Cat 24 on the version 2 uh, version 2S deck on this one. And it works lovely. <laughs> Again, 18650. I have my ENT stabilized wood in brass. This is a 22 millimeter. This one has springs is better than the magnet. Yes, I agree. The springs are easier to press. If you have trouble with your hands, I definitely recommend getting you the spring. 
But the great thing about the Endless is although the clean, the cleaner, the Empress, the dirty, all come in magnets, you can switch out the magnets for the spring. The EMT is a magnet button. Quite easy to press though. You've got a rubber seal that stops the pressure bump of your battery. Dave, if you've got some information about the Colt 45 Mech Mud, oh, uh, and again, this one hits pretty nice as well. Give us a link onto the bottom of the page, oh, Rob. Thank you. Yeah. I'm running a goon that I bought off Kevin in Brass 22. I think it's the Goon 58. Right. Uh, Darren, I don't know if you've seen my son's comments, Damien, but the Colt 35 has a 35 pound one, 35 pound spring in it, which is quite a tough spring. Now, with the dot mod, it's a very lightweight mod. I like the dot mod, I must admit, and I don't usually like mechs. It's a small airflow. And quite a small compact button. Nice and springy. Nice, really easy to press. Oh, sorry, sorry. And again, you've yeah. got your little disc in there to adjust yeah. the battery rattle. Go for that one. No, I'm, I'm going to yeah. go this one. I believe it's an aluminium tube. It's really lightweight. But on the dot mod cap, you can just see you've got a small oh, airflow. It's about Damien wrong, Darren. It's Damien on, oh, not Damien. And on the goon, you've got three of the same size sort of holes. So on my others, I have got a bit more airflow. And the airflow on the purge is about maybe three, maybe two and a half. But the goons are 22, just what? like Five, my EMT. Five, two, eight, Austin's. Oh, the goon is 22 by 528 customs. There you go. Thank you, Kevin. Yes, Darren, we'll let you off this time. <laughs> well, what did you say? You put Danny in. Ah. on. See, and I'm also on one of my regulators. I've got. My nano steampunk Tesla at night with my lush. Ethan, me and Terry are in the same car. Do you want to spell one? No, I'm just slow. Yeah, and I ain't cracking. You got your other Tesla? Yes, because you're in a slower car. Yeah, no, I have got a fair few mods. And I'm planning to get another one. Oh, it's yeah. not. It's an eclectic car for all of you. Ah, he's down here. The Colt 45 by G. The L, the, the Vape Lounge, is a single 18650 hybrid mechanical mod, competition mod. The, the top deck has, has a diameter of 24 millimeter, and the cold cap 45 has a bottom fire button, which is 35 pound spring. If you, for the next hard hitting mod. Look no further than the TVL Corp 45. Well, I've not tried it, so I will have to get you round one of those day when we do a review, and I will have to try it if you've got the Corp 45. I think he has, isn't he? Oh, Damien. Yeah. Probably not, but he was thinking about one. So, yeah. But the difference between the Endless V1 and the Endless Clean, I'll Thanks show that, you, Damien. is a hybrid disc, which you find on the cleaner. Which is that little disc there. Now, I wouldn't recommend any single cell or stacked mech to a new. What's that? Thanks for your advice, Chrissy. I've ordered a spiritual with a hybrid RDA. Nice. And as far as anyone wants to go by Ohm's Law, if you want to do a self a safe bill, on a single cell, 18650, 0.2 ohms is your safe zone. Anything for a stat which runs in parallel, you want to do a 0.5 ohms to the safe. Right? 
There is people that will style. use lower, but they are for the more experienced. I personally like my singles over stacks. And the series run totally different, so you can sort of push them a little bit more. But I don't recommend people push them if you don't know Ohm's Law and you're not reading up on the batches you're using because you've got the wrong voltage. It will vent your batteries and in some cases they can explode, which is not good. Uh, competition, so mech and RDA. Oh, nice. You definitely have to do a video. Darren, are you still going live tonight? Or are you just Love doing us. a, a bug standard chat? Not me. Chrissy, Darren says you'll be lost, but only if you can do it naked. <laughs> no, inappropriate. Well, it wouldn't be that one. My batteries are pink, Chrissy. So you've got the LG HB sixes. Good ones. Yes. Yeah. The ones that can push quite happily <laughs> at thirty-five amps. Yeah, your batteries can quite happily push thirty-five amps. As well, so really good batteries, Darren. Well, technically, they can push 40 amp on pulse and 30 amp on continuous. I like this. Yeah, I've got. Oh, I'm going to need to set one out. I've got mine here. At the moment, I'm using HE4s in my singles. But when my mods get warm, I do oh, tend to put them down and no. set the battery up. Oh, down. Down. Oh, yes, um, HB sixes and Sony VCT five A's. I recommend because they've got a better amp draw for Max. I wouldn't really recommend twenty five R's or Ethers batteries because uh, the amp draw is a lot lower on them. No, I don't that one. We've had that one. Oh, that one. Yeah, but we've had that one. Language. Language. No. Sorry. One more race, and you're going to do. No, change that. One more so, race. So, is there any more questions? Got that one, I suppose. Keep our minds. We're down to you, Darren, mate. I'll be live again tomorrow with the, the cloud source. Right? I've got three packets of six, so I'm going to spread it over three days. I'll send you a photo because you have my batches, it would be easier. Okay, no worries. So, yeah, I've got six flavors in each bag. I'll be doing them uh, six on Sunday, six on Monday, and six on Tuesday. And no, I'm not going to be here for all of them. Um, I'll save the lime ones for Tuesday then. Uh, or do you want to do that Monday? Uh, Monday night, Matt Lindsay, so yeah, Tuesday. Tuesday evening. Okay, so we've got two lime based juices in there, so I'll make sure I'll do that pack for the Tuesday. Because I'm not a fan of lime. And Terry, what are you doing Tuesday? Lime! Don't know until Tuesday. What are you doing Monday? Don't know until Monday. What are you doing tomorrow? Not a lot. Well, you come around here and I'll give you the review then. Okay. <laughs> so join me and so Terry. So be three at me. Join me and Terry tomorrow for the review on them. When's Mama going live on her own? Um, Mama will have to answer that one. Uh, Never. sometime this week. There we go. So Mum will be live on our own. Um, you've got a few flavours you can actually do a little review on, actually. Yeah. So Mum's got some flavours from Expo, so she might do a little review on them. So yeah. keep your eyes peeled. I've got reviews planned for Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. I don't know what I'm doing Wednesday yet. I might got... be at mine doing a review with Matt. Okay. Wednesday might be another review with Mum. Um, I've got some various different juices on the way in the post. I've got Competition Wind and Dark Star, so I'll probably do a review on them as well. Um, so if that's all for tonight, I'm going to say goodnight 
and we'll let you enjoy the rest of night your all. Saturday evening. So, night all. Bye. Bye. Can we say bye, you two. Bye. bye.